So you might tour in New Orleans up now. Where am I? Tell me. You're at Redfish Grill. And then you're the owner. Yes. You're at Rob Brennan. Yes. You have uh, how many restaurants in town? Three restaurants in New Orleans. And I'm a partner in a couple of others. My family has ten restaurants in New Orleans. So it's the Brennan family, everybody knows them around town here. And then you were telling me about in New Orleans there's a there's an attitude towards food that is different than some other cities in the US and I, and I think you're right. It's you leave for food. Exactly. I mean in New Orleans you grow up around food. Whether it's your mother cooking or your grandmother cooking, or you go to a neighborhood restaurant when you're young. And uh, so we grow up, it's a passion for us to cook. And everything that we do centers around food. People say we wake up in the morning and have breakfast thinking about where we'll have lunch. And at lunch, we think about where we'll have dinner. And at dinner, we think about breakfast the next morning. And so yeah. we never stop. It's, it's, I'm actually going from one place to another place, and I feel that. And I'm driving in the streets, and you feel that there's a soul here. And then it, it just transpires into the food. I don't know which way it came. It's the food transpired to the soul or the other way around. But it's, it's so warm and welcoming and, and so nice. So now I'm going to try the specialty of the restaurant here, which is, tell, tell, tell us what it is. We, we, we call these barbecued oysters. They're not really cooked on a grill. They're deep fried. And uh, then we put a, 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 a sauce on it made with crystal hot sauce, which is a local hot sauce made here. And one of my cousins was married to the man that owns that company. And so that's when we started using crystal and we put a little butter in it. And then we top it with some blue cheese and blue cheese sauce. And then is it spicy or not spicy? It's moderately spicy. Well, it's spicy no. with what? What's the spice? Uh, the, the peppers from the crystal hot sauce. All right. Yeah, yeah. And then, um, of course, they always stir from the gold. Yes, the Gulf oysters, that's all we use. Are, and and that's which you've been using all the time, right? You didn't exactly. stop using them during the spill. We did, we did not stop using them during the spill. We were able to get the oysters. Uh, they, they, we did have some issues with raw oysters because they lost the salt flavor. Right. But uh, we continue to cook with them. We, we've used these oysters uh, throughout the entire spill. So I'm going to try the signature juice of the house. Mm -hmm. All right. Exactly what you and I were saying, the soul, it just goes in here, it goes everywhere. Exactly. Yeah, so it's a very well balanced mix between the cheese and then the spices for it, yeah, great. And, and so much of what we do in Louisiana is wrapped around the seafood. That's right. why the spill was tough for us, because we thought we were going to lose our seafood. But it looks like the spill had minimal damage, so we continue to serve more and more seafood as, as customers order. It's perfect. Thank you, uh, Ralph. Thank you. Thank you.